yes, it's back. I am back with another pandemic vlog series. I wasn't really thinking I was really going to make a season two. Thing is the fact that, uh, you know, you don't have really any res as many restrictions as you did a while back when I did the first season. And, uh, yeah. But, uh, you know, seeing as the fact that, uh, you know, what's going on in the world right now, it may be another 12, 18 months from now before everything is officially settled. So I thought, you know, since it's been a while since I've uh, done any videos or anything uh, on this channel, that I would go on and uh, do another series of the Pandemic Vlog Series. Yes, indeed. I uh, really feel this is necessary for me to continue to go on about life. I've uh, pretty much started living my normal life again, but with uh, social distancing still, nonetheless, mask wearing and all that whenever I'm in public. I would uh, encourage any of you out there to always wear your face mask whenever you go out to, into the community, be it if you go in and get takeout from a restaurant, if you go grocery shopping, go to Walmart, wherever you are out in public, if it's indoors, do wear a mask, I advise. All right, well, anyway, I am going to uh, get started with my uh, game and the rest of this vlog. position the camera angle like I always would. I'll probably maybe pretty soon later, maybe the next couple videos, I'll uh, start using my hyper camera and my microphone again like I was before. This will suffice. Okay, uh... Right now, it will be the very first Ninja Turtle game. Yep, the very, very first ever Ninja Turtle game right here on the original Nintendo. There you go, right into the sewer. Already playing as Leo by default. And I gotta get used to these controls. Man, I tell you, you know, this was like the first ever Ninja Turtle game, only for it to be sheer disappointment. <laughs> but there are a lot of people out there who still have passion for this game, nonetheless. Some people even say that they like it better than the second one, which is arguably better than this one, even regardless of that. Because, uh, yeah, it's like, people don't always say that uh, this is, like, better than the arcade port that came out after this one. Including myself, I, I obviously think that that one's a whole lot better than this one, but Turtles in Time, hands down, is probably the best turtle game ever. I have no idea if that's like a fellow foot soldier you're fighting right there, but it was a boss that only took a couple hits to kill him. <laughs> Wait, why did they have to make that a boss scenario? Pizza, pizza! Oh. 
Pizza power! Man, I tell you, the Ninja Turtles, they sure wore a big thing of the late 80s and early 90s, up until the Power Rangers came along and took them out of the spotlight. <laughs> yeah, interestingly enough, though, for the past number of years, the Turtles have been outshining the Rangers nonetheless, though. <laughs> Can't believe even the VR Troopers even had the uh, Ninja Turtles outshine there for a while during, like, 1995, early 96, up until... The rest of the series was cancelled, oh man. Might as well pick some other one. Great, man. I didn't mean to go out, I meant to have Donatello whip his bow staff up in the air. <laughs> All right, I took him down, no problem. Store one of the other turtles I have held. Go back to Donnie. Oh man, it's like when they when they like duck, it's like they're blocking you or something. Gosh, man. All right, now the Leonardo leader, leader of the turtles, Leonardo, has his health restored. <laughs> man, I tell you, boy. <laughs> oh man, now we're about to lose Donatello. Oh man, now we lost one. Man down, oh boy. Well, there was just a pizza power up in that building. Might as well go in the next sewer, I guess. Oh, man. This thing's coming right at you. Face. Oh man, oh boy. I wasn't even thinking he'd be able to jump that high to get up there. <laughs>
man. Gotta fight rock steady. Oh man. Oh great no. And one more hitting Leo's toast. Oh man. Oh great. And you had to do that. Stars, boy. Oh man, Michelangelo's our only hope. Oh man. One more hit. No. Oh yeah, what do you know? Game over. Ah, excuse me there. Man, my little bit of allergies. Yeah, it says here you can continue though. <laughs> oh man, no, I didn't want to go back into the sewer. Eh, go a little too soon, I guess. Oh man. Bulldozer rams right out. Yeah, man, that thing killed. Kills you right there, it's like, boy. <laughs> huh. I'll never forget the Cinema Massacre a Angry Video Game Nerds review on this game, boy. <laughs> It's like, man, a lot of what he says about this game is so true. It's like it's not like it's like he's not even really exaggerating in that video that this game is bad. Rather or not, he meant for it to be exaggeration. It's like, man, it was like it's like a lot of that stuff really is true. Especially seeing as the fact that even with the uh, regular Nintendo and all that, Atari, it's like they were like in the early development of making games like better and all that. And making it more similar to like playing like a lot of old beat em ups and the arcades you would go to back then. It's like they just ended up being like hit or miss back then, but mostly missed because uh, I, I guess maybe just on the count of the fact that if they were 8 bit form, maybe they just didn't put much effort into not making them this intense to beat. Bulldozer ran right over Leonard. I thought I could get out of the way of it, but no. Oh man, no, we didn't want to go. Music sure is catchy out there, though. <laughs> eh, save that for the next boss. of the day playing this game in the past I'd probably be a lot more better at it although I do have the cartridge of this game but fortunately uh, my copy is defective now I probably need to get like a re one of those replacement carts things they have replacement cartridges if uh, your cartridge or like something in the game isn't working you can like get a replacement cartridge for it and then it'll like start working again
Well, my old Mikey health is restored now to normal. Unfortunately, I couldn't really do the same to Donatello, but Mike Williams won't need it anymore, I guess. <laughs> Boy. Good to know that I think I have a couple more continues left anyway. <laughs> Now I have to fight somebody from Battletoads, yeah, just dandy. Great. Ah. Raphael, you are our only hope. <laughs> Pizza bad. I need a pizza. Oh boy. again. Down you go, Rocksteady. And we have now rescued April. <laughs> Man, she has a real reason to think I'm on the news now, like in the first original movie that came out in 1990, the first ever live-action turtle movie. hit away from dying and using up another continue. Oh, man. Oh, <laughs> yep, here it comes. Yep, I had another continue left. I figured...
Down you go, Mr. Chainsaw. And how many leather faces are in this game? I lost count. And why'd they already start playing the boss fight music before I even start fighting the boss? It's like, don't you think they could have waited until I took out the last minion before playing that boss music? Man, that's just so ridiculous. some way up there. Look out below! <laughs> Man, and now we're at the part where it really gets challenging right here. Where you have to, like, disable or disarm the, these bombs here, man. It's like, goodness. Oh, man. And Mikey probably loves to swim, of course. <laughs> Okay, gotta find all the others. We got less than two minutes to disarm them. Oh man, it's like the fire stick in Mario. Time to lose. <laughs> oh, what? I'm back here again? Yeah, that's why I run through it. Man, goodness. Where are those other uh, bombs I have to disarm? Man, it's like... Well, I thought going in that further direction would get me further here, but no. Yeah, 
Round, I'll start playing uh, the. Uh, I'll start doing a. Oh man, what do you know? Yeah, I'll just play the, uh, the arcade port, uh, the second one, which is the better game, I'll admit. Oh man. Back on, we just play that one now. 